Hello data fan, hello Tableau community, this is Rodrigo Tableauing, <laughs> speaking here about my ROVs entry for the 2021 uh, competition. Uh, so you may find it a very weird entry, because it is, and I want to go through it because uh, why? <laughs> why did I build a resume? as an Agovis entry. Uh, in fact, it's not my resume. I'm using only my data in the template, but I'm using this as an uh, opportunity to give back to the community because that's what gives me joy, is really being a member of the community and being able to uh, help people to see and understand data better. So, uh, and if people can get a new job, much better. So. Uh, so I built this resume some weeks ago and I thought, oh, why not make it a template so people can really uh, just use it for their job applications and maybe have a better chance because I got some great uh, reviews out of these. People say that it looks very good, it's very neat, very sharp. So let's share the goods and sharing and all these uh, that we do uh, in the community is the thing that really brings me joy which goes back to the topic of this uh, feeder. So let me explain a little bit about the resume and how it works so anybody can uh, just uh, use it. So here, of course, you have my big photo uh, and, and everything here is data-based, but some things, tiny things you need to edit on the workbook. But you have my information here, contact, etc. Some skills, and the languages, and a personal statement. And here on the center, you have my big name, what I do, what I'm applying for. I think it's kind of some very summarized version of a cover letter. So I'm applying to be an Idovins finalist on this example, and then. Uh, of course, it's Tableau running the competition. Uh, this is my experience of the places that I worked for since 2008 when I was a inter, uh, intern. No, no, I was, uh, yes, uh, yes, 2001, I was an intern. Uh, so it's 20 years, 20 years on the job market here for me. And the education, some courses that may relevant to the position you're applying for. So that's very important when you're building a resume read the job description and try to adapt uh, your resume to fit the, the job description needs. Um, so how does this template work? Uh, first, you need to download it. So you can come here on Tableau Public, you download the workbook, and that's the first step. So as soon as you get the workbook on your computer, it's going to work look like this. And like I said, this is basically data related, uh, oriented, not related. So all the data shown here is from a data set. And what is a data set? So the data set is an Excel file, and I'll share the link uh, pretty soon. So here's the, 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 basically the profile information. So I have the big name, what I do, the LinkedIn, the email account telephone and all the other fields that are showing here, here, and the personal statement here at the bottom. Um, the skills, so that's basically the skills section here on the dashboard. So you have, um, of course, you, you, everybody here is very experienced on everything. So take a a good evaluation of the job description and put here what it means, what is important for the job you're applying for. So here are the skills that I have thought that are good for this job that I'm applying for as an ROVs finalist. And you can quickly change this here. So as you can see, just two columns and just be mindful of the text. Uh, if you want three lines, it's like this. If you want one line, it's, it's like this. So you can see here how this uh, goes. And then the languages, I created a tab for the language. You can put more language, less languages. Just uh, be mindful. You can come here and then edit the sizes. Uh, you know, you can, you can add a template later. So it's just a template. 
and finally the biggest portion of the template is the, the portion that comes here in the middle uh, the more textual one so you have the ROVs finalist this is the applying section so you change this data here and then it's going to show in this section and the logo is based on the company you're applying for and then you have the experience part you see this is the one that has several lines um, you have the start date the end date these two are used for sorting but then I was too lazy I didn't know how to do this text properly so I just persisted the text in this period column and then it shows uh, neat like this um, the logos are here so if you want to change the logos of course you don't work for IDB you don't work you're not applying for Tableau you can come here uh, go to the sheet and then you can edit the shape so you have a resume shape you put all your all your pictures that you're using on your resume on this uh, resume shape uh, folder and you should be good to align uh, this pretty quickly is the same thing for the courses so you can click here on the courses you can again you can go to the shape and then go to the resume uh, shape and I'm going to show you quickly how to save a shape on the resume shape and that's it um, and of course the education is here is the last part of the data set um, so I already did this so I'm going to return I was doing it before and I forgot to, to turn the sound so one thing that I want just to quickly explain how do you do that how you change a square picture to a round picture you can do that in PowerPoint it's pretty simple you can use the crop button here on the top and then crop as a shape circle that's it and then you can save this as a picture and as I mentioned you can go to uh, in the Mac you go to the Tableau repository shapes and here you have that resume shape and you put all your logos here so here's my picture is already there so you're getting my picture somehow but you can replace it with yours uh, of course if you replace here you need to come to the shape if you, you save it a different name uh, you will come you will need to come here and change uh, this photo here and for as you can see I put a blank container on top because I don't want people to click on my picture <laughs> but you can come here and uh, just uh, change here the photo sheet okay you can come here again it's just changing the shape uh, right here so you change that and you can pick your own picture uh, one detail the I use device designer so I have here a resume that's fully ready for mobile so you can also take a look on that uh, and finally what are the links so here are the ROVs logo you can open this so you have the the template this is the link it will be there on the viz but for some reason in Tableau public this uh, doesn't show up so you can download using this button and you can also click on the YouTube to watch this video that I'm going to upload just after we I finish recording so that's why the ROVs button is here let me close it oh and finally you can save your resume as a PDF you don't want to send okay most of the sites they're hiring sites they ask for a PDF so just click here you get a PDF and it's going to look as sharp as it can be here we go here it looks very nice okay so you can send the file you can send the link oh and finally we move the ROVs icon don't need that you don't need to send that <laughs> on your job application okay so thank you very much for watching this quick video if you have any questions just send me an email on my Gmail account or just reach me out on Twitter Tableau Wing is my handle and uh, uh, thank you for watching see you next time bye bye